So I think one of the struggles of being a hamster owner can sometimes be trying to keep your hamster entertained and not bored. Hamsters aren't like dogs and cats and you can't just throw them a ball and then them be entertained for hours and hours. They really need things to stimulate their brain to keep them busy from being bored. To start off, a good way to keep your hamster busy is to change up their setup once in a while. You don't have to change up everything, but switching out different toys or changing how the layout is can help keep them busy because they have to kind of go through, explore everything, and it's something new to them. Of course, only do this if your hamster is okay with it. Some hamsters like to have the exact same setup, but some do benefit from having it switched around sometimes. Another good idea is to just get rid of their food dish altogether and scatter feed them. When you're giving your hamster just all of its food in a dish, they basically have to go to the dish, take the food, bring it back to their nest. It's literally it. There is nothing complicated, no foraging involved, nothing. So when you're scatter feeding your hamster, they actually have to look and forage and tap into that natural behavior of having to look for food to bring back to their nest. So it can be really helpful if you have a bored hamster. Boredom breakers are another thing that can keep your hamster from being bored. The next couple of boredom breakers that I'm gonna talk to you guys about are all going to involve food because that is what I find works best for keeping a hamster busy. That is what they mainly get enrichment out of, so it's going to all involve food. So for this first boredom breaker, all you're going to need are some willow balls as well as some seed mix or some type of healthy hamster treat. And all you're going to want to do is just stuff these willow balls with a couple of treats and then your hamster has to kind of shake at it and chew through it just to get to the treat and it can keep them busy. The next boredom breaker is another easy one. All you're going to need is a toilet paper tube and some orchard grass hay and some of your hamster's seed mix. You're gonna take the toilet paper tube, just fold it and then cut a couple of triangles out on each side of it. Then you're gonna stuff the first little bit with some orchard grass hay, add some of your hamster's seed mix, stuff it with more hay, add more seed mix, and then add more hay, and then give to your hamster. And then they have to Kind of rip at it, destroy it to get to the food inside. For this next boredom breaker, you're going to need a kebab. You can get these in any pet store really, and I'll also leave a link in the description bar where you can get one. Um, but you're also going to need some fresh food or some other types of treats. So basically all you're going to want to do is string all of your fruits and vegetables onto the kebab. I also added a peanut onto mine, and then you can hang it in your hamster's cage and they have to actually work to get the vegetables down and they have to kind of chew at everything so it does keep them busy. The next boredom breaker is one of my favorites because you can do this to pretty much anything. So all you are going to need is some materials such as cardboard tubes, hamster chews, wooden sticks, basically anything. And you're also going to need some seed mix or some herbs, as well as some flour. I personally chose to use buckwheat flour because this is the healthiest type. And you're also going to need some water. So pretty much all you're gonna have to do is mix your flour and water together, and you want to get some type of school glue consistency. Once you've gotten that consistency, you can take a paintbrush and paint some onto the chew, and then quickly add whatever you want, whether it be seeds or some herbs onto it. And all you gotta do is let that dry, and you can give it to your hamster. You can take toilet paper tubes and literally make a hay-covered tube and it's perfect for a hamster to chew and destroy. So for this last boredom breaker, it is a type of foraging mat, I would call it, but you are going to need some corrugated cardboard. I've got mine from an Ikea package usually it's packaged with their larger furniture like if you buy an ikea detoff it'll come with it 
or you can actually even sometimes find corrugated cardboard in packages when you order stuff but you're going to need that you're also going to need some seed mix and a box cutter all you're going to want to do is draw out some circles and then start to cut those out and then peel off the top layer of the cardboard so that it leaves this honeycomb looking type of pattern then all you got to do is add your seeds into there and give it to your hamster and they have to rip and dig and try to shred it just so that they can get into the food so I really, really hope this video can help because I know it can be such a struggle trying to keep your hamster busy even when you've tried every single option. So hopefully these can help. So yeah guys, thank you for watching. Bye!